Hey everyone, I'm Terry G. Thanks a lot for stopping by and watching my video. If you could take a second, can you please subscribe to my channel? I'd really appreciate it. Again, thanks a lot for stopping by. What I want to talk about today, I want to talk about these, these products, these bad boys, energy drinks. And you're probably wondering why, why I might want to talk about energy drinks on an alcohol-free channel. And it's very, very simple. A lot of us out there experience emotional difficulties. We have problems sleeping. We don't feel motivated. May feel a little foggy in the head, especially in early recovery. Maybe feeling sadness. And drinks like this promise a positive outcome if we take them, if we drink these products, these energy drinks. A lot, and that's what they advertise, almost like beer commercials. That's what I sort of resemble them, their commercials as, almost like beer commercials. But the problem with these products, they're very harmful to our health. And I'll just give you a brief experience about 10 years ago, I was going through a bad breakup, a, a really bad breakup in recovery. I was not sleeping properly. I was feeling unmotivated. I was feeling sad. I saw a commercial about monster drinks. I see, you know, you see them all over the city. And I went in and I bought one and I felt better. I felt more energized. I felt more alert. I felt more motivated in my daily life. I drank them for about six weeks. So one night I was driving home from work I went into severe heart palpitations. I was sweating like crazy. I went into this huge panic attack. I called a friend of mine to come and get me. I couldn't drive. That's how freaked out I was. It went away after about a half an hour, 40 minutes, and I swore off these drinks. And the reason that I'm telling you this is that a lot of alcoholics out there in early recovery or long-term recovery may experience sluggishness, feeling tired, feeling unmotivated, feeling sadness, all those sort of things, and maybe not get enough sleep and feeling tired throughout your day, but there's underlying issues that you're having that are causing that in most cases. In early recovery, there's a lot going on in our lives. We have a lot of things happening and our emotions are usually kind of out of whack. They're up and down. Our head is racing like crazy. There's a lot of fear. There's a lot of expectation of the past and the I mean of the future going on so it uses up a lot of energy and mainly that's why we're feeling tired but there's underlying issues that are causing it reaching out for a product like this is not the solution alcoholics tend to do that kind of stuff we want a, a quick fix to our problems these things like I said are loaded with caffeine they have up to a hundred and 80 grams of caffeine to about 160 grams of caffeine. And you're getting that in a really quick shot. They are loaded with vitamin B that makes us think that we're thinking better. Taurine that works on, it's a natural remedy for anxiety, depression. Not to say that they have tons of sugar. So if you're drinking these products in recovery, I would strongly suggest not to drink them. If you're feeling tired, drink more water. Talk about your issues with like-minded people, sponsor, or go to a therapist. But there's reasons why you're feeling tired. And it's not, it's not, this is not the solution. Exercise more. Eat on a regular basis. Eat healthier foods on a regular basis. Go to sleep at the same time. Wake up on at the same time. Get some routine going on in your life. The only reason I'm talking about these energy drinks is because I did it. I reached for them and I had a very negative experience in my life. A lot of kids are drinking these, a lot of young adults are drinking these. And if you are, I would I would suggest not to. They're not regulated, they're very bad for you. For you. They can cause heart issues, high blood pressure, gastro issues like when you go to the washroom they can speed up your bowels make you have the runs and, and that's not too as a bus driver that's definitely a no-no we don't drink this stuff at all for that very reason but stay away from them alcoholics in recovery generally feel like they need to reach for something over the counter that commercials and other people are saying that are good for us that will help us out but doing it the natural way is much better so that's it folks i just want to give a brief video about energy drinks that if you're feeling tired if you're feeling sluggish don't reach for these 
do it the natural way. Make sure you're drinking lots of water. Lay off the caffeine. Go to sleep at regular time. Wake up at regular time. Exercise. Talk about your problems. Just live out the situation and your body will return back to normal, okay? That's what I'm talking about. These are harmful. By the way, this, this was my main poison I drank, the monster drink. I've sworn off these things about 15 years ago. I will never drink them again. They are very, very harmful to my health and I know they're very harmful to your sobriety, okay? My name is Terry G. This is an alcohol-free life channel where we learn to live sober one day at a time. Thanks a lot for stopping by. I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, please leave a comment below. If you didn't, please leave a comment below. But can you all do me one favor? Can you subscribe to my channel? I'd really appreciate it. Thanks a lot for stopping by. I'll see you next week. Stay sober, stay safe. Ciao for now, God bless, over and out. Bye for now.